you. Okay. So we have all of these. Yeah, I don't wanna. A lot of, a lot of pictures actually. What the hell? More than I thought there would be. Not gonna lie. So weird the controls. Yeah. Uh, uh, I don't know what the name of the damn things. <laughs> and there come with good names. To your winery. And pull up chat as well. So I'll give me a minute. I'm pull my phone first before PC because PC takes forever. Sometimes at least. Okay. I'll just put like the normal stealth. That's our one. Whoa. You drag represent so the cards represent the activities which can you which can perform. Oh, activities we can perform, you can drag and drop them on the board. The board represents the working day. Each activity occupies a specific space where you can rotate the cards to optimize work. When you are happy with your placement and ready to move on, click on triangle in the right corner to proceed the next day. <laughs> Boring company. Okay, so L2 and R. So the triggers are what I used to uh, set it up. That's pretty much all I can check, because I can't say anything else. Can I set this up right? Oh, right here. Some things activities have a special result. Press the flashing orange button to view. My I doubt you remember Emma. me. Oh, it says it. I doubt you remember me. My name is Beppe, and I am an enologist. Winemaking has ruled my life as a tyrant, devouring any free time I had, until I have reached the end of my journey, still chasing the perfect wine. There is a long list of winemakers who would be happy to inherit my lands, but this time I will rebel against what is logical or due. While we need to treasure our tradition, we also need to make room for innovative solutions, newcomers to fill our ranks. I want you to run my business and become a winemaker. It's not going to be easy, but I promise you it will be worth it. Your vineyards await. Oh no, it doesn't say that. Hold on. There you go. And it is. Oh, there are 44 followers. Weird. Now. Go away. Go away. Okay. 
There you go. So we have been given a winery or a company to take over. Hi, my name is Anna and I'm your next door neighbor. It's great to finally meet you and put a face to a name. I've heard so much about you from the old man. Yeah, I'll tell you everything about, about it, don't worry. But all in due time, I just thought it would be nice to introduce myself and greet you, so here I am. You must be exhausted, how was your journey? Well, good luck, I mentioned that. Let me, let me know if there's something, anything I can do for you. Okay, anything at all. How about that, how do I run this place? The letter wasn't particularly clear on that matter. Well, that's a great question, but you're in luck. The old man has left some instructions for you to follow, but he was a bit worried you feel overwhelmed at reading everything in one go. I'll pass his notes to you one by one when the time feels right. He has entrusted me with this task and I shall oblige. Overwhelmed is the word, so more handwritten notes and letters, you say. I gather he wasn't particularly tax savvy. Not really, he be belonged to another generation, other times, other means of communication. But you'll be fine, don't worry. Back to your question, you should really get Tio a call. He'll help you run this place. You okay, you know him? Yeah, nice guy. Tall, strong arms, big hands. He is the strongest son. He is the youngest son of the old man who runs the bakery in town. So is this going to have a love story then? Wonderful loves of loaves of bread, white bread. Granary? I think that's how I say it. Granary bread, you name it, they have it. Not to mention the cakes on Sunday morning, the smell of cakes that cremates the entire street. Promise me you will try those cakes. Oh, and Tio, how do I find them? Oh dear, I'm doing it again. I'm rambling, aren't I? I'm just a blabbermouth sometimes, right? Tio is really, really simple. Just ring him up. He'll be here in no time. Great thing, son. No worries at all. Now I'll leave you be. I have a mini, a mani petty booked at my favorite nail spa, and I can't possibly be late. You know, unpack, settle down, get familiar with the place, and, and breathe in. Can you smell it? You really don't have a clue, do you? Smell the air, girl. Smell your, Fill your lungs with it. Absorb it. Welcome to Lange? Huh? <laughs> I don't know if I'm ever going to pronounce those words right. Get yourself at home. Oh, wow. Theo, howdy. Hello, are you Theo? That would be me, yes. Great, we spoke on the phone yesterday. I really need your help. I'm ready. I am happy to help. Truth is, I was waiting for your call. You know, the old man has instructed us all. Oh, that sounds kind of ominous. Nonsense. It just shows how much he cared for you and his land. So I've heard, but I never met the man. I have no idea what kind of person he was. I couldn't... I can't help feeling that he's left me sitting on a wasteland. I almost missed the office. Oh, I don't really feel that. Having to be proved wrong, so how does this mine wine making thing work? Question is perhaps too vague. Oh, honest, I have no idea when it comes to gardening. I name my last houseplant Dodo because extinction is the ultimate fate of all of my plants. Doomed to perish the instant I buy them. Not even ex succulent. They are hard to kill, you know. Nada. No green fingers whatsoever. No cute artisanal ceramic vases not even a fancy terrarium with tiny green creatures growing inside not for me sadly you know if you ever feel like flexing this i have a distant not fixing this i have a distant cousin who is a florist in town i know do you how come how could you possibly know let me guess Anna told you bingo she told me a bunch of things about you but i disagree so what are the basics of this wine taking wine making thing i have no chance without your wisdom Agreed. So? Oh, you mean right now, I see. Okay, let's start from something easy yet fundamental, like weeding. Is it about... I'll stop you right there. It, is it... it isn't. Weeding is about preserving the moisture of the soil by reproducing the composition before the mineral nutrients required by the veins to grow clear enough. My head almost went dizzy by saying that. In short, death to weeds, long live the vines. That's a bizarre way of putting it, but in a nutshell. Great, let's get... Let's just pretend weeds are my house plants and we'll work with the term. Tutorial message, you can always disable the tutorials from settings, can please sections. Ooh. Runa, Boozia, ducks. <laughs> we have ducks. Okay, so right now we're just organizing this stuff, I'm guessing. So I am trying to put you where I want it. There you go. Finally. Thanks. Nice. 
Back graves, treatments. Let's go to, but we have no space. There we go, crafting. Crafting. Oh well. No more treatments if we wanted to. It's gonna be the same thing, so we're actually gonna continue the story then. Oh wait, okay, so this one actually can be fine like this. Which will work, right? Oh no, I actually have three. Okay, fine. There. I will put this, but it can't fit anywhere. At least not yet. So. Oh wait! No, yeah. Your business has three different buildings that handle different sides of the wine pop wine production. Click to access them and handle their functionalities. Winery Tool shed, fame, calendar. Okay. So it's talking about these then. Ooh! In the cellar, you can find all tools and rooms that you need to work on most on must such as tanks, barrels, or presses. Tools are the one required for most of the card activities and they can get dirty or broken. Ah, fuck's sakes. Allergies, annoying. Okay, so I just... How do I do this? Nope, oh, now I can't do shit. Wait, what? My game froze. There you go. Wait, what the hell did I just... Oh, I pressed both of them together. Warehouses use the store bottles ready to sell. Here you can build new rooms to handle your marketing warehouse. Level determines the amount of orders you can fulfill every year, every turn. In the tool shed, you can find all vineyard machinery and rooms to maintain them, um, maintenance them. Some tractors and tools will decrease turns number for specific activities. Huh. You have the winery, presses, barrels, machines, and rooms. Maintenance, 300 info. Water machinery. The bottle, bottling machine is necessary to carry out bottling operations. Crushing operations are carried out with this machine. Vertical screw press is the basic tool for pressing operations. Then back then they do it like by foot, literally. Fiberglass tanks have a limited capacity but are sufficient for operations. Okay. That's the works those. Then we have these, which I will still figure out what they mean by that, but we'll see. Harvest. That wasn't too bad, was it? Yeah, I guess I'm starting to get the gist of this new life in the vineyard, so now what? Harvest. We need some help with that. Oh, so there's no Harvest 101 with you this time? Not this time, we can start harvesting together, but you'll need to hire an... Oenologist? Oh, uh, I can never pronounce it. I'm just gonna put a wine, wine, wine scientist. That's what I'm gonna put. To complete this task, it's the most complex and delicate activity you will ever perform in your vineyards. There are. I think that's how you say you're meant to say a vineyard, right? Not vineyards. There's no room for mistakes. You think you're very much no pressure, huh? You are gonna be fine. Relax. Just call. I'm gonna murder it, Gaiani. Gi Gianni? Uh, I'm going with... Nah, I don't know. Honestly, I do not know. I'm just going to go with Gianni. He is the best in the area. Will do. Good, let's keep moving. Again, I am... Very illiterate. <laughs> I can't pronounce words as easy. I thought they have like, little animations. Oh. I guess the different fields, yeah. You just buy what you want to grow. Principe, Cosse, Rochi, Brunat, Brunate, or Brunette, Busia. Well, that's just Bougie. I think it might be Bougie. Caso, Principe, Castelletto, I guess. Gen. I am just gonna give up. <laughs> just gonna give up. I'm gonna be there for now. To myself, technically. And also, some people do watch these on YouTube, so that also. So nice to meet you. Yeah, sorry, I ran into another way. 
She really avoided interactions while making it an activity that requires your undivided attention and commitment. If you are not ready to devote your time to your vineyards, you will fail and most importantly, your vines will perish. Oh, I'm sorry, did I catch you on a bad day? Measly stated, he's stating the facts, so why am I here? Theo told me to hire you, we started harvesting, but we need your help to complete the task. I hear you recently moved here from London with no understanding nor interest in the winemaking business. You basically know nothing about this, don't you? Well, you don't mince words now. Are you really sure you want to help me? I promise the old man I'd help you with the first harvest and I always keep my word. I can see you have made it. Start at it, which is fascinating to me since you have no idea what you're doing. Hurry up, I'd like, like to be done with this before the season is over. In that case, how about less complaining and more harvesting? I thought exactly. So harvest, as you may have guessed, is a process by which vine, wine grapes are picked. You can do this by hand or mechanically. This is going to take a while. Yeah, it's a long and tiring process. And yes, you have to endure this every year. It's also my favorite bit and the most rewarding experience. Uh, wine scientist. I'm just going to keep saying that because I don't know. Jesse, do you know how to pronounce that? That word? Owenola just... Because I honestly don't know. <laughs> I'm going to suck at it. Please don't spoil it. I woke up on the wrong side of the bed, huh? Let's go. You're slow as a sloth. Keep moving or we will never get to the cellar. Is someone waiting for us in the cellar? Just your future as a winemaker. No rush at all. It already feels like what I want to fucking turn something on. We can name the ducks. I forgot we can. I don't even know what to name these guys. I oh, can actually put them in here too. What the fuck? <laughs> we'll leave him. So in this panel, you can see the harvest result. Now you can move the tran transform the grapes and select the tanks you can you would like to use. There you go, crushing. I'm gonna leave you. Have heart. You have survived your first harvest. I appreciate the sarcasm. No sarcasm this time. I am honestly blown away by the fact that you are still here. You're not getting rid of me that easily, so what's next? Crushing. Crushing? Yes, the crushing realization that there is still a long road ahead and I've run out of sunflower seeds. So it was you. You left the trail of sunflower seed shells in the vineyard. Another incredible deduction. I, I wish we could spend more time playing Sherlock on the vineyard, but we have work to do. Today we will crush the grapes. Now before you start smashing grapes like a brute, let me be clear, this is a gentle process. We are just bursting the skin of the grapes to expose all the inner solids. You still with me, London? Of course, all clear, just a bit gory. Focus, we'll apply pressure to the grapes to allow the juices free access to the yeast. Tan... Tannis? Tannises? I don't know. And characteristics of the skin. Tenasis, I think I say you say it. Oh. I'm a struggle words. Well, you really like to use fancy words, don't you? I am an... Yo, <laughs> Wine scientist. I'm just gonna keep saying that. A vocabulary is specific are you to taking notes. I won't repeat this. We will combine crushing with the de steaming process. It's relatively straightforward. The stems or do stemming. Are either either removed from the grapes or left attached. It really depends on what the wine maker prefers. Are you as you wish, now go crush those grapes gently. So far this game is just confusing and relaxing ish. We can put this now. I don't know what the name. Oh, I'm just gonna name it Fred. Most basic name, just name it Fred. <laughs> Quack. Don't tell me that th that not many people do that. Some activities require a larger board. You can increase the size of the board through the technology panel, which is yes. I've been reading some books about wine making. The old man has left me tons, filled with notes, weird diagrams, and old photos. That's good. Yes, but I still can't wrap my head around a few things. That's fine. It's a lot to take in. Like the pruning thing. How do I do that? Oh, pruning. You really have been studying, haven't you? The answer is simple. It's too early for you to do that. How so? Well, first of all, we prune the vines in winter. Then let's just say that you need far more than just a few books to understand how to do it. But don't worry, I can help you. <coughs> Jesse, did you just wake up, by the way? Right now, I've been awake since I say 10. <laughs> so, mine's still technically waking up. Oh, okay. How do I do this? It says I can do it where? 
Warehouse tool shed. Warehouse. Oh. Ah, it tells you everything right here too. Suckering is that what I heard? Yeah, that's what I saw. What I'm trying to figure out is where do I find? Oh, here it is. Technologies. Board upgrade. Why is why is this one more expensive than this? Oh, because it buys both, I believe. Does it? I actually do not know. I'm guessing it does. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna move you there. Okay, the amount of buds left on the vine will affect quality, quantity, and grapes ripenesses. Ripeness. Every vine variety has its favorite pruning method. So how is it going with Gianni? I'm glad you asked because, mate, how on earth did you think we could work together? Ouch. You can be a bit blunt, I guess, but don't take it personally. Blunt, he's not blunt, just plain rude. I know that I need him and his knowledge, but he is way out of line sometimes. I'm so sorry, I can assure you that he is a good man. He is just used to mumbling on his own. You know how... Wine scientists are constantly stressed out and under pressure to get the perfect wine out there. I find I can't take it. I just need to vent any. Anyway, I'm so happy our one-to-one -one sessions are back on. I missed your wine making lectures. Thank you. It's finally time to prune your vines. Uh oh, this is the level up for me. Indeed it is. Pruning is all about removing unwanted or unneeded parts of the grape vines. We prune in winter and we leave on the plants the necessary buds for next year's production. So far, so good. Anything else I need to become prince or princess pruner should know that vines can be trained with different styles of pruning techniques, depending on the grape variety. Certain pruning styles are more adequate than others. Okay, so I remove the unwanted bits and I leave the buds on. How many buds do I select these? Good question. In a nutshell, less buds, better quality for wine. More buds, more quantity of wine. It's always about quality versus quantity, isn't it? In this case, it definitely is. We want less for more quality, so I guess we're going for this one for just low, right? Yeah, okay, let's leave it for low. Now I want to. Now oh, you're fucking. You're not! Now, Briscoe. I guess I can only interact with that stuff. That I recently placed in the field one. Fermentation. Uh, there. Fermentation consumes sugar to create alcohol. You can select duration and yeast. Different yeast can give different flavors to wine. Hello again, Lynn. At last, we meet again. Indeed, I hope you are ready because today we'll cover one of the most complex parts of the wine making process. I've dusted off my old notebooks for the occasion. I also have a whole bag of sunflower seeds to chew on whenever I feel overwhelmed by your incompetence. I am rubber, you are glue. Anyway, I'm ready. Open your spell books. Open your spell book and let's summon some wine. Now, London, pay close attention. Do you remember what we have learned about crushing? Be gentle, burst the skin, release the sugary juice, expose them to the yeast. I am impressed. Well, fermentation is the next step. Yeast will now convert grape sugars into alcohol. Sugar meets yeast, and bam, here's the wine. Not so fast, Lennon, not so fast. Fermentation will affect the body, sweetness, tanning, and acid. I know how to say it, acidity of your wine. Depending on the grape variety, there are other different, there are different optimal, eh, optimal values for each of these characteristics. I cannot read today. Sure, hey, wait, are you reading from the old notebooks? I am, don't interrupt me. As I was saying, sweetness and tanning Tanian are influenced influenced by the duration of the ferment, fermentation process. Everything clear so far? Clear as mud. Unsurprisingly so. Look, I'm tired and I'm running out of sunflower seeds. I'll make it easy for you. Let's just say you are fermenting Barbera? Practical example would be helpful. Yes, let me write this down. In this case, your optional optimal values would be Tanian 2 out of 10 and Sweetness 2 out of 10. Now feel free to give it a go, even if I highly Doubt you will get this right at your first attempt, given your non-existent expertise and the base equipment you have. We have in the cellar. 
You should really add a few drops of optimism and optimism to your daily intake of sunflower seeds, you know. Two out of ten for each one. I suck at math. <laughs> uh, so I guess it would be this. Alright. Yeah, that point doesn't change, so I'm guessing these. Rera, Tigons. Aha. We get more sugar, less gallon, so. Wait. Is we're trying to get lower amount. So I'm guessing. Here, then? And I guess it's sugary taste, or sweet taste, and then none taste, so I'm just putting this. I don't know, I'm rarely understanding any of this stuff. Okay. No tennis, two per day, pinch today. No, it's two per day, if I'm correct. Modern tennis will be extracted from the skin. I think it's this that we want. There. I think that's how you do it. Reading. No biggie, I've lived in London long enough, and it's an integral part of my everyday existence. Well, in our case, it makes a huge difference. We have to stop. We can't work in the vineyard when it rains. I'm so afraid so. I see, in that case, I'll put the kettle on. Do you fancy a cup of, a cup of tea? Sounds very exotic. Thanks for the do double expression would do. Click on the I button on the card to receive more information. Nope, wrong button. There we go. Prize weed control is important. Suckering. Right, I'm just gonna say suckering, for it doesn't sound weird. It's a vital part of vineyard maintenance as it redirects the vine's energy to the most important shoots. When crews sucre the vines, they are essentially removing all the unnecessary, unnecessary shoots, resulting in fewer clusters of grapes but greater concentration of flavor in the remaining clusters. I guess we continue this one. Right? <laughs> well, if I actually have an editing software, which I do, but it's just going to be kind of bland. I'm just putting, I just put everything there as like, as a storage for all my streams. So when I do make videos, it'll be like later on, which most likely I may do at some point, possibly in the next coming month. I don't know. I don't know, Jesse. I'm gonna forget that shit out. I'm tired, I'm tired, I'm frustrated. Oh, well, is this your first time? <laughs> Wine Winish pun? Blimey, you are taking this seriously. The sooner you accept that I am here to stay, the better you'll feel. Trust me, so what's under these menu? menu? Pressing, which is the process whereby the juice is extracted from the grapes. It's pretty self explanatory, isn't it? Obviously, not increases the press intensity, and you'll get more vine. Yeah, well, every PC, I guess, comes with one, because I have one from Microsoft that I have logged in. That's why I made a little edit for, I guess, small little edit during, uh, for one of my, uh, shorts. It's just more my computer won't be able to handle shit. It's gonna take way too long, and most likely it'll have, like, a limit before I can do anything with it. <laughs> eh, we both suck. In different ways, but yeah. Now I'll figure that stuff out at some point. I'm gonna do a lot more uh, testing with that shit. All right. Anyways, back. <laughs> Increase the press intensity, and you'll get more wine. Increase the press intensity, and your wine will be of better quality. <laughs> We're this. We are in this together. Ran this down. Increase for more quality. More quantity. Decrease for better quality. Good. Remember, the press intensity will also affect the value of two characteristics, which are body and tannin. <laughs> nah, okay. In the context you gave it, no. In the context you're thinking of it, yes. I can't tell what context it has. You're pressing a bar 
Barbera, keep in mind that the optimal body value is 8 out of 10. So I, I'll give it to go and see what happens. Now your generation is not particularly keen on reading, but you do. You can also collect the Dwayne data to get a right balance. It should be easy enough for you. Eight out of ten, so that would be this. This one they want. Okay, we can focus on weeding again and suffering. Actually, no, right down here. There he is. Battling, so here you are. Damn, you look tense. I am. Today we'll be we'll start bottling the wine. This is the final stage in the winemaking process. The moment of truth. Once the bottles are sealed, there are, there is nothing more we can do. It's out of our control. You really concerned about this? Of course, anyways. Even more so, given you had no clue about the entire process. Bottling is irreversible. There is no turning back. Next time you see your wine, it will be in someone else in someone's glass, and they will be tasting it. My first wine, I have learned tons along the way. Whatever people say, it won't be it'll be on me and not on you. Since I am the uh, wine scientist and your mentor, it's my responsibility. Responsibility. The only thing that makes me feel less helpless during the process is to make sure that the bottles are sparkling clean and the corks are top quality. Good to know. Let's inspect the bottles and hope for the best. Okay, turn barrels. We're going to do it this way. Make sure you have enough space in the warehouse for your bottles. Remember that sometimes the closures can give faults to the wine. Oh wow, you can actually like, see a 3D design of it. Cool. Aesthetics, quality, aesthetic, agglomented, glass, cork. Why is the cork so much? Uh, it's not that expensive. This one's more expensive though. I guess we're gonna go with small amount for now. Yeah, we'll just keep it the same. Oh, this doesn't change anything? Okay, I'll need the label. We'll do double. Like 7.2. <laughs> 0.3. 60. Like what? 0.7? No. 0.20 something. No, oh, fucking no, not 20. Okay. Yeah, we'll just keep it the same name. Alright, so machinery is subject to wear and can get dirty or, bro or broken. Each piece of machinery can be cleaned and repaired by accessing the building it belongs to. The use of this, the use of dirty machinery can affect the quality. So, hey, girl, long time no see you. How are you doing? And I've been buried in work. Apologies for ghosting you the other day. Yeah, I hate you when I am late. So that's the way you ran away so quickly. I thought you were avoiding me. You, but tell me, how are you two getting along? Uh, Gianni is all about the wine. He doesn't mangle with us in town. He is also difficult to read. Tell me more. I am afraid I don't have much to offer. The only thing I know is that whatever he feels particularly stressed, he chews on tons of stuff, flower seeds, and leaves a trail of shells behind. You. Right, anyway, we have to just finish bottling our first wine. That's literally what I wrote it as. <laughs> Making wine in 100 days. That's literally what I put. But with a question mark, because it doesn't take 100 days to make wine, I don't think. Does it? 100 days are in two months. Oh, no. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm over here doing math and I can't do it right. Wine tasting. We put here. And clean. Nope. There. No, 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 no. Go back. Evaluation of the wine is expressed by score. Oh, the evaluation. This value depends on the tip. The Tipa, tipa, say, tipa, type of quality, tipa, type of quality, of the wine, the quality of the grapes used, the flavors increase the score while false decrease it. <laughs> Home Depot, that's mean. That is 
That's mean, Desi. Eh. Three, two and a half stars. It's not bad, per se. So how many do I sell? On stock revenue zero. So I guess it wasn't too bad, per se. Journal thing. So Barrera is known for its deep, colorful body, low tanias, and high values of this of acidity. When young, the wines offer a very intense aroma of fresh cherry cherries and blackberries. Huh. Cool. Oh, you can buy stuff. Which is a lock, though. Even if I had enough. Now, yeah, welcome to my wine bar. Do you have a reservation? Hello, not really. Sorry, it was just my last minute. And Rihanna told me to. Oh, so it is you. Nice to finally meet you. I've heard so much about your first steps in the winemaking business. And it has filled me in on your adventures. Really the unofficial news broadcaster in town, isn't she? Tune in to Radio Anna and learn about what's in the news in the area. Well, she is, but she has a big heart. She only broadcasts positive things about people she cares about. But listen, why don't you just sit at your table, that table over there, and tell me about your first wine. I'll be there in a sec. Uh, so much story. I actually thought this would be, like, a lot more, well, less talkative, technically. There's a cat. Nah, no worries. I don't mind. If I do that, okay with you. Looks like you have met Barik. Barik. And judging from the rheumatic, rhythmic uh, purring sound I hear, I say that he likes you. <laughs> have you not found any work yet, Jesse? Wasn't that the whole plan to do at some point during, like, during this summer, technically? The whole plan is to look for work? The whole spring and summer, technically? Which one else have? <laughs> I am not judging you. I'm just saying you're not sticking to your plan. That is all. <laughs> and don't fuck me. I haven't done anything yet. I'm just stating facts. You really had to do that. I'm not sure it's good. You do feel. Eh. You're the one who brought it out. I'm just saying you just don't stick to your plan. Not really feeling judged. I'm just saying. I'm just stating what it is. <laughs> Fucking looks like saying stupid baka. Oh god. <laughs> Stay in my lane. What do you mean? I'm not driving. And if so, we would technically all be running everybody over. Explains why I'm not allowed the car no more. I know you've been studying hard, working hard, and are fully committed to the cost, but how do I say this? This wine is actually good, all things considered. Deep color, full body, low thing is well done. <laughs> no, you're not. You're not sorry. Is that are you sure? I mean, I feel free to say it's rubbish if you don't like it. I don't mind, but like, you're not sorry. <laughs> you're not sorry. No, this is good, especially since your first wine. Anna was right, you do know what you're doing here. This is the menu, order what you want, it's on the house, celebrate. Okay, thank you, and yes, I know I was right, I really need to leave the house and meet new people, I'm feeling so much better. Staying as long as you like, I have to go back to the other tables, but I definitely want to know more about your future plans. <laughs> now that's going too far. No pay you to visit as soon as I can, and that's a promise. Two new orders? No. Oh. So prevent treatments, don't cure diseases, use them to prevent the vineyard from becoming infected. And might, yeah, it's fine. What's, no, I want to choose either one. Do 
You clicked on so you can click on the vineyard to get information on its health state, ripeness, and get new card treatments. Satoshi, who is she? Emma, newcomer to the area. She's working with Gianni and Tio in the very. Where you want? Eh. <laughs> that is not. That is a lie. In the very same vineyards that once belonged to the old man. Fascinating. Is she any good? She is the beginner, but I've just tasted her wine and believing it's kind of good. May I have you drop a few bits of your conversation, as you always do? See here, reading newspapers cut up a very barrack and spend your time listening to my client conversation now that i think about it i might start charging you an extra for the free year before you get here in my defense i am a wine journalist and listening to what people think and say about wines or sellers is actually part of my job your wine bar is my favorite dis dispensary of local stories stories i have a renowned appetite for these kind of tales you know that i consume them variously i know i know so do you think her story could become one of your pieces it's too early to say, I have to dig for more information. Get to know her better, see if there is more to her than meets the eye. The fact that she is working with Gianni is captivating to me. Here we go again, Gianni, your known personal Moby Dick. How was the wine, really? I salute your bravery for drinking it in front of her. It could have been a disaster. Can I taste it? You should still have a glass of the precious Ambrosia. Very right, luck, I do. Do you feel like you're in the right mood to taste it now? Indulge me and please leave me alone. I have to think this through. Of course you can stay, Barry. So now we just take care of the plants, I guess. Now look at it slowly. It's changing, actually. Which is nice. This grape is different. Cool. Now look at it's actually working. That's nice. So it's literally what a pleasant surprise. Hi hey, Emma, how are things? All good, thank you. What brings you here? Look, I know you're not well acquainted, but after you left my winery bar last night... My wine bar last night? <laughs> What's that for? I kept thinking about you and your situation. I have experienced the same issues being the outsider than coming to the area. Yeah, the alien in town, that's me. You're doing everything extreme. You're doing something extreme. I mean, you haven't just opened a new wine bar like I did. You are becoming a winemaker. This is huge. Many people have had their eyes on these lands for a long time, you know? And the fact that a rookie is now going above and beyond to make proper wine is driving them nuts. Honestly, I don't know what to do about it. I am not a quitter. I know, and I respect you for this reason. I have also decided that I want to help you with your business. I want to be your client. I want to buy your wine. It's not much. I know, but it's all I can do in the moment. I am happy to put publicly support you. You're joking? This means the world to me. Team Outsiders for the win. <laughs> sure, this won't damage your business. I mean, I do appreciate your enthusiasm, but my wines are far from being perfect. To me, don't worry about it. You do... Do you? I'll take care of the rest. Thank you. Thank you. All right, one more thing. A friend of mine would like to interview. His name is Carlo, and he is a wine journalist. Would that be okay with you? I'm not sure I have anything interesting to share besides something like Toro Nu to Langi to... Or Langhe. To run a winery with zero knowledge. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. That article would practically be very interesting. It would be a real eye-opener. Anyway, Carlo will be in touch. Now I'll leave you in your vineyards. I think I'm just looking for you. Oh, he must have finished his daily dose of sunflower seeds. Which we look. That is a big field. Yeah, that, one's, that looks a lot better now. That's good. Okay, so we can't do any of this yet. That means so it looks like it's fine. Special orders must be completed in order to gain fame and ensure a good income from selling more bottles. If an order is beyond the player's abilities, it can be discarded for same prime. Fra tank prime. Uh warehouse. Times one capacity five thousand. So we have loads. Shells and change. Pallets determine the number of bottles that can be stored. It looks like we're fine so far in storage. We're not making too much. We're not making too little. Still no machines. Winery. Cleaning. 
Can't do yet. Exactly. Still harvesting. Can I access it? No, I can't access it. No. God damn it. These controls are so weird. There. Two random orders here. Your favorable effects, wine prey, base price, number of orders received, type of special orders, and the ability to unlock new technologies. Hello, I'm Carlo, the journalist we spoke on the phone a few days ago, remember? Oh yeah, sure, hi. Nice to meet you and thank you for your interest in my adventures. Your endeavors are definitely worth my time and interest. Thank you for welcoming me to your vineyard. Winemakers tend to be extremely secretive and shy, so that's refreshing. Whoopsie, I didn't know that, but yeah, it told me that it wasn't the best idea to be into it. Certainly, McCree, if you want to kill it, call it like that. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. The controllers, though, it's just the controls on here is just fucking weird. Gunny is old, is old school. It doesn't surprise me, but I am not interviewing you now. Today, I just want to browse around, and take a few photos to get a general. Understanding how you run this place, are you happy with that? The photos will be featured in the article. Do you to give you the tour? Okay, concerning your interview, if you're still up for it, I'll give you a ring and we can set a date. You can meet at Satoshi's, no one will bother us there. No, that's easy. Alright, so looks like we got crushing. Got more, more grapes coming down. How much do I have in stock still? Because I actually don't even know. That's wine orders. Yeah, I need to keep an eye on that. Just completed your own 502. Oh, wow. Actually. Yeah, we're actually doing perfectly fine right now. Which is surprising nonetheless. Warehouse. Okay, so we have 2,600 right now. So, ain't too bad. Ain't too bad so far. I'm the vines right now. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> I think I could buy an extra one if I wanted to. Actually, no, I can't. Too, uh, too big. Invitation. We'll add right there. Okay. Two out of ten is what they want for sweetness, so... We'll do this one. We'll see how this goes if I do this. We'll do... No, yeah, we'll do one pitch per day. There you go. Am I doing this right? Oh, bam. Oh, it's near 2023, what the hell? Hey, Emma, glad you make it. Are you ready for the interview? Of course, are you Are you going to record this? Do I have to say off the record if I want to add my personal comments on something? Should I get an interview? Emma, calm down. This is just an interview for the local newspaper. You are not on trial. And no, I am not recording this. I am also going to rely on pen and paper. This idea of entrusting a machine with my notes is trying to be asking to me. What did I get? Hold on. Uh, the idea of interesting a machine with my notes is fabricating to me. I want to smell the ink while I write. Feel the paper under my fingers. Sure, until you accidentally misplace your notebook, give me a ring in that case. I'll teach you a thing or two about saving data in the cloud. But what happened to a range? I think I'll stick it to my first notebook thing. Anyway, let's get cracking, shall we? There you go, ahead. Okay, let's Nothing to available from these things. Uh oh. Uh, that'll be winery. A 
you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Come on, come on. There you go. So, info, data, okay. Can we buy more of the fiberglass? Aha, I can. Okay. I'm gonna buy one extra just in case for later. Does it get that little issue out of there? We got pruning, which we gotta do right now. We'll do very little, actually no, we're gonna do... We're gonna do quantity instead, we're gonna go up here. Quantity for a bit. See how that goes. Nothing really to fertilize yet, so we'll leave that on me for now. Not if it stays. Go. Oh, it's dropped a little. So restaurants, not much, but uh, dropped a slightly bit. We're selling too much of it. Nope. Uh, warehouse. How many do we have left? We're fine. We can upgrade the warehouse, huh? Nice. There you go. So, not in use. Intensity. We'll go slightly big more on tan tanning just to see how that goes. In the winter, two millimeters. Yeah. And it's slowly going up now. Ooh, we got new ones. Okay. Uh, cleaning. Okay, first, weeding. Right there. Suckering. We. There. Bottling. We will figure out how to organize these in a bit. I need the cleaning first, though. That's what I want. Okay. So let's get Biasco over there. Bottling. Hmm. Okay, so we can't do bottling yet, so we're gonna leave it. For now. Nope, we're gonna keep doing suckering. Use those for a bit. Since I believe you still have a lot in warehouse. Yeah, need a bit. You can increase it by one. There you go. Also buy a pallet rack if to. Okay. Now we can do more bottling. Right there. Oops. <laughs> Just deleted it. Damn it. Actually, yeah, I want to. I'm gonna change these a little bit. <laughs> kind of pricey, but it may actually may help a little. So. Okay. Need the cleaning. Wine testing. Right there. Oh, the controls. There we go. There you go. And that's dirty, which we'll be cleaning in a minute. Um, how's Brasco? Looks like it's fine. Yeah. The grip seems fine for now. It'll be fine.
the city is good to pick any. Oh wow, that's gone up now. It went up by a lot. So, Barbera, I guess I just gotta mess with the sweetness and tanny in them most of the time. Looks like everything else is doing fine. Yeah, okay. Not bad for my first time. By myself. Yeah, we're going up. Slowly. Hello, Anna. You look great into there. You're famous, and I get to be the next door neighbor of the new celebrity in town. We're not looking at the bigger picture. It may have started as a short interview in the local newspaper, but now it's the talk of the town. It may have helped a little. Please don't get mad. What have you done? You are the queen of gossip. I'm most scared to have. You may made a bit of noise. I'll keep that. Give that to you. But that's not the point. Hear me out. I bought a few copies of the newspaper, and then I casually dropped them around town. Now to sell it off you, have I strategically placed a few copies of the newspaper in the best shops in town, including my favorite nail spa, and now just a few weeks later, they're all talking about you, my favorite nail oh, star. Of course it is, they're all going to Satoshi to taste your wine, I've also heard Varric is getting quite famous, I'm not surprised there, cats always go viral. In a few months, your will be again for another few make my words. Anyways, I came here to give you this, you haven't made it, uh, old man's second letter. And read it to yourself. Just messenger girl. <laughs> Got new orders. Uh, we can upgrade the board, I guess. Twenty thousand? Uh, never mind, I can't. <laughs> uh, no, that's out of the way. Another. Got two different bottles. We made a new one. Bottle aging unlock this update in the technological technology something. Yeah, so these are selling a lot better because we got this elasticity. I think we need to get figure out more tanning and sweetness. Maybe. Let's see what is really going on? Emma, Anna told me you have received the old man's second letters. Is right? It is. I'm still a bit confused, to be honest. Because you just need time to digest, it's okay, but on the right side, I can finally give you access to a bank deposit in your name. The old man set it up in advance so that you could buy the land next to this and expand your vineyards. Are you telling me this is all part of his plan? Yes and no. Yes, the old man has foreseen a few of your moves and prepared accordingly. No, no nothing was set in stone. The only reason why you have received the second letter is because you have earned it. Can you buy that land? Yep, go ahead. You will also need to hire an agronomist at this point and i take the liberty to contact a friend of mine his name is luca here is the number you say if you thank you he's the physical work we gonna i am not sure i can have the two of them it trust me i like him so i remember we're doing fine okay yeah it's going up and down slowly that's doing its own little thing so soon we can buy this one is what it's saying then, which would be nice. Treatments. Do downy mildew. For now, do both. Yeah, we're earning a lot of money now, fuck's sakes. Yeah, let's name this other duck. Uh, so we got Fred. Hmm. We'll name it Claire. There. Fred and Claire. Thing. Hey Jesse, I didn't even notice you left. <laughs> yeah, so that that that's healthy as hell. So you don't need to check on that anytime soon. Uh, special orders. Uh, 
I have to discard them because I can't sell anything to them. Oops. Nope. Nope. Selling. Nope. Selling them. <laughs> I'm not trying to do anything. My fame is level 6 though, surprisingly. Uh, I need to keep an eye on my warehouse. How are we doing? Uh, we're fine. <laughs> we're fine in warehouse right now. Uh, okay, let's see in winery. Presses. So barrels are for like fermenting, right? So we don't need that yet. Or for uh, aging, which some do actually help. Okay, we're gonna need cleaning on that. And the crusher is fine. Can we buy bottle machines? Rings ball. Oh, we decide. <sighs> Give me that. That actually might be helpful. Twenty fifteen thousand. That works actually. <laughs> that works a lot. Oh shit. Okay, we're gonna have to wait until cleaning. So we have two turns before that thing disappears. I believe. All that money we just earned, we're earning back soon. Alright. The binds. Uh, we'll leave it on that for now. There we go. Crushing. And then we're going to add the cleaning as well. Get that out of the way. Get some more cells. Yep, pretty much that $15 that I just spent, I literally got back. Yeah, unsuitable weather. We have loads of wine for now, so. <laughs> you keep leaving and coming back, kid. If you're just going to keep leaving and coming back, just put a lurk. That's if you want. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, I know. He may need another presser. Nah, eh, we'll leave it. How about the tool shed? Can we buy any machine? No, not yet. How's this? Yeah, I suppose it's fine. That's healthy for now. So we got fermentation we can work on. Oh, wait, no, go back. We're gonna try more sweetness. With pitch, two bitches, and we're gonna go with Tenny and a little more. And the watch time never works, you know this. You have to, that one, I believe I have set with something up with the. Uh, we go with quality now. With, um, what's it called? Nightbot? I think I have it disabled though by accident. Where is the watch time that I had for that for this? I mean, <laughs> I haven't been on streamers in a while. Let me check. No stream elements. Let me check that real quick. While we uh, finish this order right here. There you go. Why we got to find yours? I've earned like 3,000 back. I already have one. Twitch. Yeah, okay. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Give me the code. Damn it. And I'm locked. So I had that already authorized, but I guess something else happened. Okay, let me go to chat box, chat commands. Okay. Apparently we have an account age as well. Hold on. I'm gonna see how this works. This account's been live for five years. 
you know I've been streaming for like yeah no actually that would make sense just minus two years from that and there you go done hands off redeem what do you mean I've never seen that one before I have eight ball cancel duel chat stats commands I feel like you can see all of this stuff too. Follow age. We'll turn that one on see if that does anything. Gene slots, tip, sound request, uptime, watch time. I'm gonna reset that. Oh, that's when I dropped my controller. <laughs> yeah, it's mostly used for like Apex or like any of my any of my like FPS games. Like if I get into disabled or something, yeah, or any game technically, I just have to drop the controller for like I think five minutes. Was the rule or ten? It says that I'm not following my own account. What the fuck? No. <laughs> well, that, but no, not at all. I can get points. What the fuck? Jesse, type in account age. I want to see how old your account is. Man, I'm sounding like crazy, though. Alright, got some more, uh, more stuff to do. Yeah, three years ago, yeah. Yeah, just minus two years from when I created my account, and there you go. You know how how long it's been since I streamed. Is that incorrect? You start. You made your account when uh, when uh, Robert started streaming, no? you can actually look up those <laughs> created seven years yeah so yeah so the amount so the time pretty much your accounts anniversary is my anniversary for streaming give or take give or take a few months or a few days actually I still remember the, I still remember the day when I first met you guys it was fun Ooh, cost return we can increase yeah seven years Wait, for Sky Fox too? Oh, that's his count, yeah. I wonder how long he's been alive. Well, been, like, live, like, when he actually started streaming. I mean. All I have to worry about right now is just the cells. That's what Press. I'm gonna go a little bit down slightly. There. Woo, we got a giant spike. <laughs> been, been very chill, and I'm scared of what's gonna happen soon. I want to save it to get another field because I want one. <laughs> uh, not really, because he's he streamed I think like three nights ago. Am I wrong? Let me check. I know he was live like a couple days ago. 
we always streams in the middle and like around like 11 or 9 in the mo 9 o'clock in the day in the night so i don't know i'm gonna look it up Woo! what the hell are you doing no fuck you my eye twitching eh. okay There he is. So last time we streamed, oh, I saved streams like three years ago. I know he streamed a couple nights ago. What the hell? I guess he doesn't have it activated no more because I'm not finding his things. Yeah, huh? He only has the clips from like three years ago. But otherwise, doesn't have anything else from recent. That sucks. Well, that's where he was live earlier. I just don't like a few days ago. I just don't remember when. By the way, <laughs> I'm not hallucinating because I get his. Well, maybe I am hallucinating, but I get his uh his notifications a lot. So We'll leave it as how it is, because I'm not making too much. June 7th? Of this year, or of when? Because if it's of this year, then I was right. If it wasn't, then uh, that's a whole different question. Okay. Yeah, we'll actually make a new design. Go with I go with nine and we'll go with dark. Yeah. All right, so we are cleaning. Don't mind tasting again. Prop thinning. You can fit right through here. There we go. That's still fine. Rotation aging can provide hints to the wine. The flavors increase the quantity. Yeah. I need to mess around with it a little bit more, but it should be fine. I only dropped like a dollar. Oh, it looks like it's fine. I'm going to change it up at some point. City one, type of city right. Okay, yeah. That's a lot of orders, actually. Oh, we can't sell much, okay. Um, okay. Sadly, because they're gonna have to be leaved. Listen to it later. We're making more right now. How many do I have in the warehouse? We may have to save up now because we're starting to lose them. We don't sell a lot, we might as well just do it like that. Because we do not barely have any. Yeah, we're, we're losing too much. Okay, 
We may take one of these because we don't really need two grants. We'll be fine. Turn on the sweetness. We'll do nothing. Yeah, we'll leave it this long. See how this goes. Ready into net into year twenty two twenty five already. I gotta be careful because right now I'm running low. Okay, we're gonna have to just make it with the same bottle for now. Let's see how this patch came out like. Let me click it. Thank you. Yeah, but it's the one with a quality uh, of 75. Cool. We got better. Yeah, went to bed. Got a little bit. Yeah, they sell a lot more. So sweetness is the right amount. So we need to keep it where it's, where it's too sweet. So it's that's helpful. So it for a good portion. Use the pace, the payout, which is nice. Okay, Emma, I hope you have replenished your aura because today you'll need your energies. Alright then, take care, Jesse. I think I'll be ending stream soon because, yeah, I gotta go to sleep. <laughs> I, got, I got work tonight. That can stay alive for a bit. It'll be fine. Oh, there. Got some cells we can do a little there, and we'll do that one. This one. Okay. I don't think I'll have any more, do I? I still have the warehouse. I have, I have like loads. No, we're running low. <laughs> running low now. Oh, uh, that's we can only have up to five. That's why.
imbalance. Expenses are normal. Income balance is going up, so we're fine. Since this one can last a little bit, we can leave it. How much do we have left? We're fine. They don't really ask for much anyways. Highest is like around a hundred something. We're doing fine. It's a very chill thing. <laughs> okay. Harvest that. No. Nope. Ooh, we got a lot more. Quality good, quantity uh, or so grab that. Okay, we can go for back for quality over quantity instead of uh oh wait wait. I said the quantity, right? <laughs> I hope. Harvest waters. Yeah. Ah, triangle activate to its these. Okay, cool. We can buy this now, but I think we'll leave it. The finances allow it. The new vineyard by selecting it before purchasing is possible. To check the to so. The fermentation that we gotta work on next. Okay, they wanted to have it on totally like that. They want high amounts of tanning, so we'll do this. Just to see. Do one. There. I like that, which would be the good point. The good portion for now. Where's... Oh wait, whoops. Put the fermentation away. Damn it. Okay, everything's still the same. There. Do we have in the Oh we barely have anything else in the others, that's why. Okay. We barely have any. Okay. Looks like we're running low, so we may have to stop selling. <laughs>
Ooh, we got a clean fiberglass. Point of chiming. Yeah, gotta sell some bottles now. Heat waves. So drought has hit the vineyards. The quality of harvest will drop. mess with quantity now again because I think we're running low on the amount we have maybe so this one has a whole bunch we're trying to get the barbera which is this one instead of these two so we'll need these Oh, this one because it still has a lot. So. Okay. I think after this turn right here, I'll leave it and end stream because I gotta go to sleep. We'll do nothing. See how that goes. And below, so customers prefer an below in this period, and below wines can be sold at a higher price. We need more quantity right now, so we're gonna get more. Where's over at least? That's it. I have heard of the tanning, though. That's good. Now that should sell a little bit more. Yeah, 1,300. Not bad, yeah. Okay, I think on that note, we'll save the game as a stream. And we'll leave it at that. Now I'm just trying to too. Yeah, I gotta go sleep. And you guys won't see me until maybe we stream with Sunday or Monday, counting on how the day goes. Or tomorrow, but we shall see. Till then, I will see you guys next week. Adios.